there and welcome to Neophyte.tv, the technology show for the not so geeky. My name's Tiffany Young. And I'm Ben Freeman, and today on the show. Hey. A couple of cool Shoot. iPod slash iPhone accessories. Ooh. And the first thing we're going to look at today is by Mophie. Okay. And uh, this is the Mophie iPhone juice pack. Take a look at this. Oh. Yeah. And what this is, is it's a little holder or case for your iPhone. It's nice. Yeah. And, and what I like about it is that I drop my iPhone all the time and this has like rubbery sides. Ooh. And you take your iPhone and it slides in the sides. But what's cool about this is, it slides in just like that. Oh, nice. What's cool about it is it has a built-in battery. Uh -huh. So while it's in here, it's charging your iPhone just like that. Wow. How does that feel to you? It actually, it's, I was surprised. It looked like it might have had a battery, but it's so thin and light that... It is thin and light. Right. And uh, it just goes on like that. And what happens is, is it will use your, um, you know, it will use its battery first before, and, and while it's charging your phone. That's nice. And then when it's done, your phone takes over and, mm -hmm. you, and you can also then pull this out. It does add hmm. a bit of bulk to the case. Here's, here it is sideways. Take a look. So maybe just to be something you keep in your car, or your briefcase, or... Yeah, you can keep it in your car, your briefcase, it can be an emergency. Now, uh, and if you plug it in to a charger, mm -hmm. it will charge both its battery and the iPhone battery. Do you know which one? It, does it charge the this one first, then the iPhone? Or well, just it's, always, it's always charging the phone just by its battery. So, that, so it charges the phone first, and then it charges itself. Take a look at this. Speaking of, can you see that? I don't know if you can see they're not. Look at the, this is from dropping mine. You drop this? And that's oh. because these things have these really slick surfaces. I, I have I dropped this, I don't even know how many right. times. So this so. has a really nice rubbery that's nice. Uh, feel on the sides. Um, the only thing I didn't like about this was you can't, it does have a thing for charging, but it won't sink to your uh. computer while it's in the case. You have to take okay. it out the sink. So the next model needs to sink. But I think, you know, um, my wife likes this because mm -hmm. she likes to, she has an iPhone and she likes to listen to like audiobooks mm -hmm. in bed and will fall asleep sometimes with an audiobook on. And of course then it plays all night. And by in the morning she wakes up and it's drained. Sure. And so what she does with this is she just plugs, she charges this up during the day while she, you know, she, so she keeps this plugged in mm -hmm. during the day. Mm -hmm. And then at nighttime she comes home, puts this in here and listens to the audiobooks with this under her pillow. Yeah, it's great. And in the idea. morning, this is dead. Uh huh. But this one is still, her iPhone is still full. And if you'll take a look, uh, I don't know if you can see this, but it's got a little button on the back. You push the button and it shows you how much juice it has left. Oh, that's nice. It's got one out of, I, I, uh, she must have used this last night. <laughs> it didn't fill us alone because it only has one out of the four LEDs. But it tells you how much power is left. Boy, I hope they uh, come out with stuff like that for that, that new Sprint Intuition phone. Yeah. It's supposed to be the new I, the Sprint that. iPhone. Um, well, I almost bought this, and then I thought, you know, the Sprint has, in, for the areas that I go to, right. has so much better coverage that I can't afford to lose those calls. So uh, This is kind of pricey, 99 bucks. $99. So you really got to yeah. want that extra talk time, but yeah. it is the sveltest extra battery I've seen. It's rechargeable, mm -hmm. and it, it really fits well. I'm so. sure it's great for travel. Yeah, but it is pricey. How long does that battery last, do you think? They say it doubles, like, I think you've got, you know, like, regular eight hours and mm -hmm. it'll double it to 16 or four hours so you of watch movie. full movies yeah, when you're it, traveling it, it like basically and... doubles the battery life of the phone that's nice yeah yeah that is the Mophie iPhone very juice very pack. Um, uh, nice innovation as far it as is, design. it certainly is designed well mm -hmm. uh, I don't know if you notice here there's a little gap at the bottom so when your phone rings you know the speaker is right here if it does ah. if you butt it up straight against it it right. will block the speaker sure. so they do that so that when your phone rings you can still hear it very cool yeah like it now our next uh, product is this. This is from ProPorta, and this is the ProPorta Shine. Oh, I like that. That's cute. ProPorta Shine case for, <laughs> I thought you would like this. And what's neat about this is it's not only a case for your iPod, but it's also a mirror. Oh. So you can, like, put your makeup on. There's something stuck between my teeth. It's like a little, exactly. You can look. There's a little salad right here. <laughs> oh, that's adorable. Yeah. And I have a little, what's nice about this, too, is that when I, um, you know, bike or, actually, this feels pretty secure. Yeah. Um, you can hang that right on your handlebars. Hang that right on your handlebars. Would you mm -hmm. use the mirror, the little mirror thing Probably. in there if you want to, like, check to. your makeup or all that sort of stuff? I see you. Yeah, this is nice. Yank her away from the mirror. <laughs> See, when, you know, I don't even carry a mirror anywhere around. I rely on other people's kindness to tell me if something's not quite right. Right. Which, on some occasions, I've gotten home and been like, why didn't someone tell me there was this thing? Seven. So that is so that's uh, nice. 39 bucks for that, which is a nice, cool, little double-purpose case. It's pretty good protection for your 
-huh. your iPod. Uh, you know, it's going to protect the corners if you drop it, I think. Yeah. And it has the mirror built in. That's from Very Apple. nice. So that's the Mophie iPhone juice pack mm -hmm. and the Purporter Shine for iPods. And Two cool. How much is this? This one's $39. 39 Okay, gotcha. Yeah. And then it comes uh, probably in a lot of different colors. I think it came in like three different colors. Okay. So not a lot, but two or three. Two or three, okay. And maybe they'll, you know, these often come out in one or two and then they'll add more. They're beta testing them first. That's right. Okay, very nice. And uh, that's it for this section, but we have another profile coming up right after this, so stay tuned. What do you do when you get frustrated by your computer? Whether you have a simple question or it's a major computer crisis, write down the number on your screen because I can help. I'm Luke Ford, founder and CEO of My Computer Works. If you have a small business or a home computer, My Computer Works is your personal computer help desk. Whether it's a big problem or a simple question about your computer, simply pick up the phone, call our friendly American-based technicians, and we'll connect directly to your computer and fix the problem for you. It's immediate, safe, and secure, and doesn't require a stranger coming into your home. And we'll never try to sell you something you don't need. There's no problem or question too small. We can help. My Computer Works is now serving thousands of happy customers all across our great country. It's fabulous, and I can call as many times as I want. If my computer starts acting up, I call. It's the best money I've ever spent in my life. For a small activation fee and only $19.95 a month, you can call us when you need us. Now my computer works. Does yours? And welcome back. And Tiffany is like uh, uh, <laughs> you lost me for a minute. Distracted by the shiny objects. You said like room. the antennas, yeah. Do you the like shiny that? objects. <laughs> it's so shiny. It looks very. It's actually so big. It's uh, yeah, like... big and shiny. Two things Tiffany loves, and smooth, <laughs> and cylindrical. Uh, cylindrical. All your favorite terms. Is that a new word? Cylindrical. Cylindrical. Is that in the dictionary? Cylindrical. Did you just make that up? This product is by M I guess I have to look it up. Cylindrical. It means a cylinder. Cylinder-like. Oh. Cylindrical. Okay. It's just nothing new. That's all. I've never heard of it. Ooh, look at this. <laughs> shiny, mm. shiny. It's got a little spot in there for this is the, the uh, This is uh, iPod speakers by M Station. They're this is the not M Station. Messing around with these. Nope. M Station wow. 2.1 stereo tower. And the nice thing about wow. this is it's floor standing. And by that, I mean it's standing on the, the floor. floor. <laughs> and uh, basically, you take your iPod. Let me uh, pull up some. Here, let here. me just like, is it real heavy? It is pretty heavy. Oh it's my got, God. Okay, no so it mind. has these. These are the uh, little um, speakers, and these, these uh, come off. This is how they, they come shipped. These are the tweeters. Oh. Okay. And used then, to be the, my nickname. Tweeter? Yeah, my yeah. dad. Because I was watching Bambi this one time, or I was watch, reading the story, someone read me the story, yeah. and I asked my dad what Twitter paid it meant. That's Twitter all. paper. Okay. Yeah, you yeah, remember what Bambi's so That's not paper? Twitter. That's, I've never it's actually totally seen off topic, Bambi, but... to be honest with you. Um, but uh, you've never seen I've Bambi. I've never seen Bambi. I hate to tell you that. That's like Little Women. That's like Dyer Van Frank. That's like up. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> you take your iPod. So inside this cylindrical tube is the subwoofer. Okay. So there's a subwoofer down here. Tweeters up here. This goes on like so, and it comes with like four or five different little. You know, adapters? Adapters for different iPods. So can you use it with an iPhone? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Turn the power on, the light turns blue, and hit play. I don't know how loud we have it. My kids were playing with it earlier. Crank oh, good song up. too. I need to borrow this and download your song list. Okay, now I haven't turned it up yet. It also comes with a remote. Oh. And the remote lets you like crank up the bass. That is nice. Wow. Okay, you ready for a little volume? I... You give me something I can hold on to. I know you think I like the other people. You saw your name number on the wall. Thousands of people have that memorized. Uh -huh. Eight six seven five three zero oh, nine. Good thing it's not like That's a real my number. ATM code, actually. So you know, I really hope nobody ever gets my card. <laughs> uh, it's got controls on the top, so you can. I, this is fantastic. You like it? I cannot believe how fantastic the sound it's, is. It's loud. It's wow. loud, good this quality speakers. This is a perfect um, system for like outside patio underneath, you know, your your pool when you're yeah, at the party. I don't think it's like stuff. weatherproof, right? Well, no, you I mean, you have to like yeah. take it out. And then but you know what's great about it? It doesn't take up much room. It stands yeah. in a corner. Mm -hmm. You don't have to put it on the counter. Now, every other iPod speaker we've ever yeah. had goes on your counter. Exactly. Well, after a while, you've got no more counter. That's right. 
And my, this is a big thing my wife has. Whenever I bring home an iPod speaker review, she's, she's like, like, oh. Uh, what do you that? Counter. Exactly. So we found this. We tucked it in a little corner. Yeah. It's kid height, right? My sure. kids can use it with the buttons. Right. They put it on there, and now they play Susicle all day long. Susicle <laughs> at top volume, <laughs> dancing around the, the uh, oh, living that's room. that's great. Uh, going, uh, going uh, notice me Horton. <laughs> this is a great um, speaker system. Yeah. I, now, as far as cost-wise... What do you think? Well, we'll get to that. Oh, oh wait. We're we'll not going to. We're going to get to all the features first. On top about. here is a line in, which is cool if you want to plug your computer in and watch a movie on your computer while Great. you listen to this. And it has a USB port, which you can connect to your computer so that while the thing's in, it'll sync. Great. So you've got syncing and sure. line in for another uh -huh. device. So if you want to plug in your TV or plug in whatever, it's great. Tell me again the manufacturer. Uh, M Station. M Station. M Station 2.1 okay. Stereo Tower. I don't know if you can notice this on here, but it picks up dust and dirt really easily. Yeah. Um, so to a couple of faults. Let me get some, there are some faults, some okay. issues. Uh, number one is it picks up dust and dirt really easily. Okay. Number two is the remote almost only worked from like straight on. Mm -hmm. If you were like five or ten feet either side, mm -hmm. I couldn't get it to work. So this is like an afterthought. Well, see, this is what I thought. When I first saw the remote, I thought it looked like an afterthought. Something about the remote. It's huge, isn't it, it? Well, it doesn't look like it just goes with this. I mean, it's the same colors. But it's a big remote. This reminds me of the remotes that go with the little handheld yeah. desktop-y things. And it's, the problem is, is that the remote just doesn't have the greatest range. I have a question. Yeah. Can you use those universal remotes to um, program? That's a really These good guys? question. I think you can if you use one of the learning ones where you know yeah. you point this at right, the and remote you learn. and then you learn. Yeah. Right. It won't have the built in numbers because like the too Logitechs. Many like the Logitech. Yeah, I've got you know I've got the one new one, the two hundred and fifty. Is it called? Exactly, yeah, it's a Harmony. The Harmony CEO. Yeah, yeah, for two hundred and fifty dollars. Like yeah, I've actually programmed my fan. <laughs> I learned my fan. So, uh, freestanding, pretty big, good sound price. What do you think? Do you think that um, we can? Here, can I lift it out? I want to lift. I just want to show the viewers real quick what it looks like, how big this actually is. Okay. Okay. Here we go. I am so strong. See that? I see that. Wow. See, it's anyway. That's heavy. Yeah, it's like a big. But at least H. you know it's not going to blow over, so that's no, a good thing. No, it's not. It's, it's solid and it's good, and it plugs in with okay. one cord at the bottom. And so you asked me price. I asked you price. What do you I think? Focus. It's worth? Um, ooh, um, one seventy-five, Bob. Very close. Two hundred. Oh, it was so. And close. actually, it's one of those ones where I found it like anywhere from like you know. 180 up to like 260. I mean, mm -hmm. it was, there was a lot of variation on the internet, but I think on Amazon.com it was about 200 bucks. That is nice. And you know, it's, what's so nice about it too which is, is that... it's still way cheaper than, say, the Apple Hi-Fi when it came out, sure. which was in the threes, and the Bose is in the threes. Yep. Uh, you're paying. It's like paying for those lucky jeans. So it's been the name brand. That's right. So, um, great price, and um, I'm really impressed with the M Station. Yeah. The sound is fantastic. And M Station makes a bunch of different speakers. So I'm telling you, In fact, do you remember that room. green ball? Yeah. Yeah. The green ball, a, that was M Station. This has, that's why I recognize remotes. the remote. Yes, it came from ah, that big green ball. That was the I M Station I just saw that this morning. That was months fact. ago. Yeah. Yeah. The, um, yeah, so very nice quality. and um, Cylindrical. Uh, nice usability. You know how um, it's just a pain in the high knee to get um, speaker wires all over your living. And there's just such a great innovation and wave of new wireless devices or devices that are so mobile. Well, I gotta tell you, I like it, um, but I dock it a point for the remote control, which I think is, uh, as you say, an afterthought, doesn't have the greatest wide range, mm -hmm. and it gets dirty kind of quickly. But other than that, I think it's great. I would give this a four out of five. You know, I'm gonna give it a five out of five. I'm so impressed with the sound, even though this is not, um, it does seem like an afterthought. That's okay. Um, the sound quality is fan. This is a huge room that we're in right now, a huge studio. And that just, we weren't even on what, maybe a three or four as far as volume, and it really filled up the. It was getting up there. Was it? Well, when I cranked it, it was okay, up there. Okay, but like no tinny, tinny, like, no, you know. No distortion. That's because it's got that big subwoofer in the mm -hmm. cylindrical base. Oh, there we go. Thank you. No, okay. Thank Four you, Ben. Five, for five Tiffany. out of five for me. Five out of five for Tiffany. Yeah. Four out of five for me. Nine out of ten mm -hmm. for the M Station 2.1 nice stereo Nice product, tower. M Station. Good job. Nice product, M Station. Mm -hmm. Good job. <laughs> That's all the time we have today. Tell us what you think. Is it too big? Is it too small? Would you like this for that price? Send us a comment. Let us know. Neophyte.tv is the website. Uh -huh. And we hope to see you here next week. Absolutely. We'll see you then. Send us an idea on anything else that you'd like to see. Make sure you send it over, and we'll see if we can get that product in and get it reviewed for you. And if you happen to have an extra 30 seconds... Take a look at this. Hey, I'm Andy Walker. 
Have you just bought a new computer with Windows Vista on it? Or maybe you've got an old XP computer that you upgraded. Well, we've just created an amazing new DVD that will teach you everything you need to know about the new operating system from Microsoft. It's called Getting Started with Windows Vista. In this DVD, there are three sections. One is out of the box. What do you need to do as soon as you start up Vista? Number two is Vista Essentials, things you need to know every day to make your computer experience amazing. Antivirus, security, all kinds of new features that Vista offers. And finally, geek tips and tricks, things you need to know that nobody else will have told you to make you a Vista guru. For more information, check out our website at gettingstartedvideo.com.